Hey everybody, this is Jess with Blush Jess. Thank you for watching today. I've got a cord that I'm trying not to have in your way. This is my very simple weekly layout. I have said before, I only share this to show you that you do not have to spend a lot of money on stickers to make a planner work for you. I do have some stickers and washi tape here, but you don't even have to do that. Make your planner work for you. Um, I cannot say that enough. Um, you should be able to plan in it and uh, customize it to what you want and it doesn't have to cost a lot of money or um, a lot of time. It should save you time. If you like to decorate, great. But um, anyway, I'm just going to show you what I do with my planner and my meal plan for this week. So over here, I like to write a little encouraging note. I've seen a lot of other people do this too. And I think it's just so important to kind of have goals for the week. And mine just says, you've got this. Keep tracking and killing it at the gym. One day, one meal at a time. Remember your goals. Um, and then here is where I put anything that I have to do that day that's kind of important. So you have a little to-do sticker. Um, I went to the gym at 5 five o'clock in the morning on Monday. So I like to kind of schedule my gym time. Um, today is when I'm filming, this is Tuesday. Um, so I need to go grocery shopping and then I'm gonna do the gym at PM when my husband gets home. Tomorrow is another gym at 5 a.m. and then I need to do some filming for YouTube. Um, gym, my husband's probably gonna be going into work late. And so I think I'm going to go after he takes Nate to school and he can watch Lucy. And then Friday I can go when he gets home from work. I do not like going at 5 a.m. Only Probably just only once or twice in the week. Otherwise I get way too tired. Um, our rent is due. So I'm to make sure I pay that. I have a little weekend um, flag thing. Um, and we have a meeting on Sunday after church. Then... This section, if you've seen my planners before, is where I write um, how many steps I got that day, how many points, smart points I ate, and then track my water. I did not fill this in from yesterday, so I need to do that. I got, I know I got over 15,000 steps. I stay within my points, and I got water. I just need to put that in. Um, and then every day I'll be able to look back and see what I did. Down here is where I put meals. So let me just kind of share with you my meals this week. Um, we went trick-or-treating last night, so we just had pizza after that. So I just put a little sticker that said, good times. We had so much fun. Tonight, I'm going to be making spaghetti for my husband. And um, I'm going to do a spaghetti squash, and we're going to have salad. Wednesday, we're going to have nachos. Thursday, I'm going to do chicken in the crock pot. I have a creamy chicken um, recipe, and then we just use that on rice. I have had this on my meal plan for like three weeks. I really need to make that this week. I'm going to make a white pizza, and then Saturday I'm going to make taco soup, and then Sunday is leftover. So this is just a very basic layout. I hope you enjoyed watching it. It's very functional for me to keep track of my goals, my points, my steps, any major thing you have. So if you like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, and, I'll, and subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, y'all.